certainly you knew that something had happened, something had important had happened. When I walked into Sardis that night after the show, we walked into Sardis, and they and people stood and applauded, you know, which was the theater standing and applauding and taking cognizance of work that had been done, theater work. I was very impressed, very pleased. That was the trip from that first thing, that uh, from Shakespeare and the rest of it, to that moment. What? How would you describe the significance of Raisin in the Sun? Oh, the significance had to do with how, you know, later one thing happened that made me even understand, two things happened that made me understand it. One was uh, a black person when we were just in Philadelphia before we went out on the first stop on the road where we had no audience, or very little audience, very little black audience, for the first half of the week. And by the end of the week, the theater was full, and it was black. And, the, and my understanding, as I got it from a woman who bought a ticket that she couldn't afford, she was coming down there to see something because people in her neighborhood had told her there's something that's going on down there that concerns you. And she had to find out what it was. That's why she was there. And it had to do with something I'd said about the theater and why black people were not in the theater. And it had to do with the fact that they didn't see themselves there on the stage. I said, they're not themselves. I said, the, the maid that comes in in the show and does this is still not them. It's, it's a black face, but it's not them. They in themselves are not represented in the theater. So what's there to come for? And that's what Raisin and that's did. that's what Raisin did. And it was, of course, first black director on Broadway, first black play, first black playwright. It, you, you truly made history it at was, that point. Yeah. Truly yeah. made history. Did you, did you expect at that stage that this was going to be the beginning of, in essence, a, a major theatrical movement that your career yeah. really personifies? Well, it is. I know I didn't realize it in its totality. I know that you do something that's successful and somebody else wants to be a part of it for whatever reasons they want to be a part of it. They want to see you or you take on a different meaning to them. I knew that. But uh, the totality of the sociological and historical things that were involved, I had to accumulate and come to deal with as life went on.